Alright guys, welcome back once again to another video. Today I'll be focusing on the rebounding part of NBA 2K19. So there is three aspects of rebounding. But before I get into those, I want you guys to drop a like and go ahead and subscribe. And also, um, the three aspects, they do are all different, but the last two kind of have to do with each other. So positioning, um, timing and breaking box outs and getting into the box out position that's why they kind of have to do with each other so let's focus on timing first your timing is always going to be um crucial to obtaining a rebound so if you don't have the right timing you're going to miss it you sometimes even when you do have box out there i was kind of off because i got thrown off by the double bounce on the ball because sometimes they're not always going to need a single bounce there is another double bounce so you just have to jump every time you see it hit the rim there I didn't have positioning so I did have the right timing timing but not the right positioning so timing you're always gonna um, wanna hit triangle or um, Y when you do see it hit the rim even with their own boards um, but um, of course without timing you also need positioning so positioning how you obtain positioning you either turbo in front of your defender by hitting your right uh, trigger and then you hit L2 or you could swim around them by uh, moving your left stick stationary or moving doesn't matter until you get in front of them and then you hit L2 and then you should have the good positioning for the rebound so breaking box outs of course as you can see me there I already had the um, the box out because I was, he was a much weaker opponent than me so I easily just hit L2 but when you do have another glass cleaner on you or just a big center in general who knows how to get boards you do have to know how to maneuver around by using your left stick by altering the box out or um turboing around them then hitting l2 maybe moving your legs in front of them by moving your left stick as well so like i said from the beginning guys you're not always gonna be able to get every rebound i know that's what it says in the title but using all of these are going to increase your chances of grabbing every rebound because sometimes the ball is gonna maybe do a triple bounce a double bounce maybe you timed their your triple bounce and no, your your single bounce right so let's say it bounces one time on the rim off a miss and you jump there but then your opponent didn't jump and then they jump for the second one and then they get it so sometimes um it's not always gonna work and that's not gonna be your fault so but if you do have positioning so let's say if there's a double bounce on a miss on the rim you do have positioning and you don't jump at all and then you wait for it to bounce all the way out you're, you're gonna hit the board so as long as you're doing all of the stuff I said in the video, you're going to get every board. But if you do only do like one of the aspects, of course, you're not going to grab it. So anyways, guys, make sure to drop a like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.